Okay, we're going to be talking about graphing inequalities. In the previous video and the forms that you did, we talked about the symbols. So all these symbols are familiar with to you. I just wanna make sure you understand how they work on a number line if I was graphing an inequality. Okay, so this is not graphing on a coordinate plane. This is just graphing on a number line. In graphing inequalities, you have two parts of that. You have circles, where does that start? The circle is where it starts. And then you have an arrow because an inequality has a range of numbers it can be. So just looking at this, if I had, um, if you, looking at the symbols on the left, if you look at greater than or uh, less than, this would be an open circle, okay? So, and you're writing this all in your notes. So this is an open circle. Okay, I, it can't be this number, but it can be numbers outside of this number. Okay, so outside of the circle. If I have in the next line here, less than or equal to, greater than or equal to, or equal to, it is a closed circle. Okay, and if I had just equal to, if I was looking at uh, x is equal to 1, that would be a closed circle, no arrows, okay? It's just equal to one. It could be one, okay? And that's a closed circle. It can be one, okay? And so that, that you should have experience doing that. At the bottom, um, the second part of graphing an inequality involves arrows, okay? So let's look. In, on, the, on the left, we have less than or less than or equal to. Notice that the symbol is pointing in this direction, and that is the way the arrow would go. Greater than or greater than or equal to, the arrow would go to the right. So let's look over here at these number lines, and let's do a couple of them. Uh, let's look at x is greater than negative 1, okay? So it's greater than. It can't equal negative 1, but it's going to be anything greater than negative one. So I'm gonna put an open circle and notice that the greater than sign, the arrow is going towards the right, okay? So my circle is open. I wanna make sure we understand the circle is open, okay? Because I can't get in there. I can't get in there. I can try to blast my way in, but no, that open circle is going to keep everything out. It cannot be one, it cannot equal one. Okay, it can equal everything more than uh, negative one, but can equal negative one. Okay, so now let's look at x is greater than or equal to negative one. How does that change it? Well, it can equal negative one. So now I'm closing that circle in. You see, it can. See how it is similar, similar to this one over here? It can equal negative, uh, it can equal negative one or it can be anything greater than negative one. And notice again, my arrow is going in the direction the symbol points, okay? So the difference between these two, in the first one, it, it can't equal negative one, so the circle is open. And in the second one, it can equal negative one, so, and the circle is closed. Okay, let's look at x is less than one. Okay, now it's le cannot equal one, so I have an open circle, okay, right? All the, the uh, things can't get in, can't be negative one, it can't be one, can't be one, but it can be everything less than one. And notice my arrow is going in the other direction and it is also in the direction this symbol is pointing. It's going in that direction. And the last one we're gonna do is X is less than or equal to one. Okay, so it can equal one. It can equal one. And say, we're here we go, same as up here. Okay, it can equal one. And my arrow is going to be in the direction, again, that the symbol is pointing. It can equal one, and I'm going in the direction the symbol is pointing. And that is basically it. You just have to uh, look at the direction of the symbol and figure out if it is can be equal to, it's colored in, it's closed is what they is how they describe that, but it's colored in. Yes, I can do that. I, it can be that number. 
But if it isn't, then it has a force field around it. It can't be that number. It can be anything less than that number, but it can't be that number exactly.